Okay, good day everyone, this is Oliver and today I'm going to show you how you can match a BH, a BVH file to a 3D character. So we need three things. The first thing, of course, Blender. The second thing, um, we need a BVH file, which you can find uh, on Google. So if you um, type in in Google dot b vh mocap file you should find um, this gfx minus uh, motion capture minus uh, minus motion minus capture dot blogspot dot com so you find a lot of different things which you can download and use and the third thing is of course the pipe rig of Nathan Vectal from the Sintel page you can download it okay so let's start by opening this motion capture file with import motion capture dot bvh search your file you have of course at first to extract it and then you can import it here you can also scale it but we can do it now so we can't see it yet so because it's very very big so we will fix it by scale it that it fits on the 3D grid. Okay, you can delete this cube, we don't need it. So now, scale a little bit more. Okay, now I'm gonna import the by brick group by brick. Do not uh, import the mesh because it doesn't work, uh, will not work. And so you have all the, this whole thing and not the only the, the different parts of this. So you can see now it won't work because you have not the T pose and the here is the animation in. So what are we going to do? I'm going to uh, we or I going to do to dope sheet editor. Go from dope sheet to action editor. Click here on F to fake user this action because if you save it and uh, try to reopen it, it will delete this action if you will not act uh, have not activate this. Um, because now we wanted to unlink it. Now you see the yellow lines disappeared. Um, and now we gonna to move this right into this character and now go to the pose mode, select everything and press Alt R so that you have now this um, T pose and scale it up so that it fits into it. Now we need to make a little trick. So click on this, um, yeah, if you haven't clicked on it, you should click on it because you, sh you want to select the uh, these vertexes behi uh, behind these ver uh, upper vertexes, um, vertices, sorry. And yeah, without this you can't select them. And I'm going to pull forward these elbow elbows, and now I'm going to move it right into. Okay, then select me the mesh, then the armature. Press Control P, la Control P, to uh, armature deform with automatic weights. Weights. And now you only need to select your armature. Go back to the dope sheet editor and select again the backflip so that these yellow lines appeared again appe appears again and if I click on now on play you should see that this whole thing works perfect okay that was my quick tutorial thanks for watching and see you later